The champion has a name. And it's Islam Khashev, brother. Okay, you read the title. UFC is better than boxing. And this is why. I'm gonna be covering the two latest events. It just shows how much UFC and MMA just and MMA is just better than boxing. So I'm gonna cover both of these huge uh, sporting events because both of them have some weird shit going on. So let's start with Mike Tyson versus Jake Paul. So here is the thing: it could be scripted, it could not be scripted. The fight was as the women's fight before that was a lot better. But here's the thing. People say it's scripted. My thing, I, I don't think it's scripted. Uh, Mike Tyson is old. He's just an old guy. He can't fight anymore. It is not scripted. They say in the script Mike Tyson was not allowed to KO Jake. But here's the thing. Mike Tyson cannot KO Jake. Jake Paul has a better chin. And he was holding back. In He, he was holding me. Look, look at the fight. Jake Paul was holding back against Mike Tyson. Mike Tyson had wobbly legs. He couldn't throw normal punches. He did good in the first round. And then all of his cardio went downhill. The, the re uh, Here's the thing. The script came out after the fight. And then people start saying that the fight is scripted. But it wasn't. Because like... It just is not scripted. Like... There is so much... Proof that it's not scripted. The, 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 the script that people say is scripted is fake. It's just made by some guy who got sad because Mike Tyson lost. So that's about it. So boxing is dumb. It uh, it's, it's, it's not a good sport anymore. MMA is better. Okay. UFC 309. A, a, a event 10 times better than Mike Tyson versus Jake Paul. But, that, but an event 10 times not so famous as Jake Paul versus Mike Tyson. But it should be but it should have been more famous. The fights on there were, were way better than Mike Tyson versus Jake Paul and it's MMA. They the better fighting sport. <laughs> so here's the thing. UFC 309 uh, features an epic fight between John Jones and Steven Miocic for the heavyweight title and John Jones won by spinning back kick and then and then TKO which was very good fight, and there's a chance that he can fight Tom Espinel because Tom Espinel said next week that he, that he will have huge news and stuff like that. But the comment was even crazier with Michael Chandler jumping on his back two times and almost knocking out Charles Oliveira after Charles Oliveira had a dominant win. He, he was 4 0 against Michael Chandler, and Michael Chandler in the final round just became a dog and, and almost killed Oliveira with the back of the head shots. Here's the thing. They were back of the head shots, but it it just it it's the forearm that hits the back of the head. the the fist like the back fist itself was landing on the ear sometimes. But but you you could count like fifteen back of the head shots, but but it's entertainment. Nobody cares. It's the final round, and uh, so and and the other fights are also amazing. Uh, I was kind of sad that. Uh, Hafiz lost by brutal overhand. He lost. I, I said he won, but he lost. I don't remember the Mickey Gall fight. I watched it, but I I, I just don't remember it. I, I don't I don't remember it happening. It's kind of weird. The the Ruffy fight was amazing. The guy he fought, a lob top was his name. He had a ten out of ten chin. He was uh, Ruffy was landing elbows, overhands, jabs, crosses, everything. But the other guy just won't go down. It was. Bloody and brutal. Now, what do I want to see from both of... What should be the future of both of these events? Jake Paul should get beaten up by Ryan Garcia. You know what? Fuck it. Let Jake Paul fight Francis Nagandu. And uh, that's about it. For John Jones, you should fight Espinal. For Michael Chandler, I, I, I think he should fight Max Holloway for the BMF belt. I, I really do think he should do that. Charles Oliveira is getting a title shot, of course. But uh, this was it. Fight was not scripted. It wasn't. Debate me. And uh, use an MMA is better than boxing. Bye, everyone. Have a great day. <laughs>